Well, JPDC, as I mentioned earlier, we are a um, federal government agency. Uh, our sole purpose is to make sure that the project Pengerang Integrated Petroleum Complex happens. And the key to this is obviously getting the right investors in. Um, so what investors should know about JPDC is we are almost like a one-stop center in terms of making sure that uh, from your decision to invest in Pengerang until it happens, um, you only have to deal with uh, JPDC uh, as far as um, you know, investment in Pengerang is concerned. So, um, and and um, you know, we do provide um, supports along the way. We do provide sort of uh, uh, guides along the way. And uh, we do believe that um, you know, once you've decided on Pengerang, that will be um, you know, your best decision that you ever made as far as uh, in investing is, is concerned. Um, at the end of the day, we do foresee uh, Pengerang or PIPC in this case as a location where all the necessary supports will be there. Uh, as much as possible, we want to make it seamless for you to come and conduct your business. And JPDC, we will uh, carry your burden for you in terms of uh, your issues. We just like you know, you to focus on what you do best in terms of um, your, your investment conducting your business in, in Pengarang. Well, um, being central, being central uh, as far as ASEAN is concerned, being one of the uh, two most developed company, uh, countries, economies in, in, uh, in ASEAN, I think we are strategically located, uh, be it by road, uh, be it by sea, we do have that connectivity. What Singapore has, we do have that as well. And if you talk about rail connection, you talk about um, uh, road connection, infrastructure connectivity, we do have that um, to offer if you locate your business in, in, in Pengarang. Um, at the end of the day, uh, logistic is, is key and we are wrapping up our effort to make sure that it's up to scratch when it comes to connecting uh, Malaysia, Singapore with the rest of ASEAN. And ASEAN, um, we are actually uh, lucky in a way because notwithstanding Singapore, a large part of uh, ASEAN countries are in this unique um, uh, uh, demographic dividend where they are the producers and they are the consumers as well. So we have a huge market and Malaysia and Singapore are well positioned to take um, advantage of this with the, uh, say, freeing up liberalization of the uh, banking sector, um, maybe um, you know, movement of uh, labor to certain to certain extent. So um, yes, we, we can take advantage of the, all those because um, I, th I think we are we are ready um, to make sure that this this happens as we move forward.